Hey everyone, welcome back. It is time for another tech tip and in today's video I show you how to add a password to your computer and a shortcut to lock it quickly. Check it out. And of course, if you are new to this channel, we do a lot of how-to videos, tutorial videos, and videos just like this one. First and foremost, let's make sure that you actually have a password that is on the computer. To do this, no matter the operating system that you're on, go ahead and get into your start menu. Either find and click on control or start beginning to type the word control and then left click on control panel, left click on user accounts, user accounts one more time, and then you'll be brought to a page that looks very similar to this. What you're going to want to do is click manage another account. This will show you all accounts that are associated with this PC. Go ahead and select the one that you would like to add or change the password for. In this case, I'm going to do recording. Click on change the password. Type in your current password, new password, confirm the new password, and then also type in a hint if you'd like. And this is the steps if you already have the password. If you do not already have a password on the computer, the only difference is you will not have the current password box. It'll just ask for a new password, confirm new password, and then type the password hint as well. Whenever you have all of the settings or information typed in, go ahead and click change or create password, and that will change the password or it will create it. And then what you're going to want to do is learn how to lock the computer when you step away. This is a great method. The easiest and most universal way to do it is if you look on your keyboard, usually in the bottom left or right hand corner of the keyboard, you're going to have a little button that looks like a Windows. What you'll want to do is hold that down and then click the L button, L is in Larry at the same time, and that will lock the computer. And that is the most universal way to do it. And then once you've got that done, you can go ahead and log back in at any time and that will help keep your computer secure. Thanks everyone for stopping by and watching that tech tip. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you hated it, thumbs down. Leave any kind of comment or feedback in the section below the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and we will see you next time.